What do horses and singing have in common? You'll find out when you see what we're up to this week. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me why! We'd seen these horse-drawn carriages trotting around downtown and decided to give it a try after dinner one night. Hey, bud. How you doing? I just thought he was nice. Okay. Gray horse with black hair. He looked kind of emo. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> It was a little silly cruising through downtown at the crazy speed of barely faster than walking, but it was also rather soothing just listening to the clip clops. I will say that I fully understand how touristy these carriages probably are. I'm not sure if locals use them or not because we did learn during our ride that a couple members of the San Antonio Council submitted a consideration request to ban horse-drawn carriages in downtown. Some reasons that were cited are inhumane treatment of animals and environmental impact. Their suggestion as an alternative was to switch to electric carriages. Now let me know what you think here. Is it inhumane to have the horse-drawn carriages downtown, especially now that you know we have cars? Should they be banned? And would you actually be willing to try the electric carriages that have been proposed? Let me know in the comments because this is an interesting conversation to have. In the meantime, who wants to grab some drinks and see how badly I can sing? Well, too bad, we're doing it anyway. I love dueling piano bars and Howl at the Moon is a franchise with 16 locations spanning half the country and even on the high seas with Norwegian cruise lines. Time for libations. All right, so I have been sent up here to get one of these cherry limeades, okay. two of the pineapple upside down shots, and water. They're not <laughs> the pineapple upside down shots were good, but that wasn't the only drink I got. This is a cherry limeade. That is an alcoholic cherry limeade. Those were some tasty beverages, and with drinks like that, comes this guy. Hey, I warned you there's gonna be some bad singing. But wait, there's more. Anyone that knows me and pays attention to this channel probably knows I like Star Wars, I like Ghostbusters, but my favorite film series is Back to the Future. So I kind of did a thing in the form of requesting a song. Happy I got to hear my song I requested. Don't worry, the singing gets even worse, and we're gonna continue it until you smash that subscribe button. One, one. Yeah. Yeah. You think I'm kidding? I've got more. Tell me why. Hold on, we've got another one coming in over the request line. I feel like uh, sending it a Venmo request. And you're like, I want a journey song. You know the song I want. I'm so sick and tired of playing my song. I don't care. I've 
never actually been to a piano bar before without hearing Journey. It was strange. I mean, not only is that a great song, but Becca and I like to pretend it's kind of about us. Similar to the lyrics, she's from a small town in southern Kansas, and I'm... How are we feeling? Can we stand one more round of bad singing? Because the hits keep coming in over the request line. And the next one is a preview of a concert we're going to be going to in a few months. Care to know what that is? Catch you next time. Having a good time.